Hello guys, I'm uh, Saramut Bears and today we will play with a large battery. So this is... This is it. This is very nice battery and it takes a lot of energy to charge it. So let's hook it up. I will remove these four floor gratings. And we will connect it to the electricity. So maybe here. Like, uh, I'm expecting something, it will probably happen, so let's see. So let's take a look. <laughs> so yeah, the, the battery is charged, but one cable didn't survive. So that's not how to do it. Guys, if you don't want to burn the cables around your base, we need to use uh, transformers. So I will take this small one. And I will put it here. So, with the scroll button on the mouse we can change the direction of the electricity flow so we want to the input on the left and the output on the right now we will connect it to the grid So we have it connected. So let's do the next step. So now we will change the output of the small transformer. So we will set uh, some power on it or an output on it. So we will set it to 2000 and I will turn it on it doesn't work now because it doesn't have anything what is taking electricity from it so I will turn on this uh, large battery and now we can see the transformer is working it is making a lot of noise of course and the large battery is charging so if I will turn off the large battery the transformer will turn off as well because it doesn't have anything in the grid behind the transformer to supply with electricity so this is how it works basically and we will do next step I will connect the large battery to this small grid, let's say testing grid. So we have it connected and we will do something funny, I promise. Let's do the magic. 
So this reader here will read the battery. And it will read the ratio. I will turn on the battery. So we can see some number here. We will use that number, the ratio number from the battery, for this logic writer. So input will be this logic reader. The output will be this LED display. The variable will be settings. So now we can see the number, like the ratio number from the battery on our display. But we don't want 0 0.10, we want a percentage. So now we will program this memory number one and this logic writer will read this memory and the output will be this LED display and the variable will be mode And now we can see our battery is charged like 10% of uh, full capacity. And here we can see what is happening in this electronic circuit behind the battery. So now I will turn on the small transformer and if we did it right we will see the battery is charging. So this is the way how to display the percentage of charge of a large battery or a stationary battery and of course you can do it for a large grid but there is a one thing I need to tell you if this circuit is running behind this battery it is taking the power from the battery all the time so if something wrong will happen in your base and this battery will be discharged completely this circuit will not work so good thing is if you will split this circuit with these logic units to a different grid so it will display the data from the large battery all the time and it won't discharge it on its own so thank you very much guys for watching subscribe for more bye bye